Volume matters when it comes to hypersonic weapons for both tactical and strategic reasons. Hypersonic weapons travel in the upper atmosphere at speeds of more than five times the speed of sound or about 3,853 miles per hour. China's recent test of a nuclear-capable hypersonic glide vehicle has received a massive amount of attention. The test demonstrated that the United States has fallen behind China in hypersonic missile production and deployment. So the U.S. Air Force is making rapid progress with its air-launched rapid response weapon, a hypersonic projectile designed to launch from an aircraft. Meanwhile, the Army reports it is on track to deliver its new long-range hypersonic weapon by 2023. The Pentagon needs to not only have operational hypersonic weapons but large numbers of them to rival or deter China. But the hypersonic weapons are too expensive. The Pentagon's budget request in the 2022 fiscal year for hypersonic research was $3.8 billion, which was up from $3.2 billion the year before.